Hello there! First of all, we're gonna fluff up the hair 80s style. And for that, Ellie is using the volume master and then a curling iron to get the curls going. And we bet most of you are here for the lizard effect, so we're gonna keep the base makeup guide pretty brief. Start out with a primer of your choice and then head on for the foundation. Ellie is using two colors, one light, one darker, to do some shading as well. Then heads on for the brows. And here she's outlining the brow with a little lighter uh, foundation to make the brows pop. Then we continue with the eyelids, getting the shade on there, using a gold eyeliner here. The choice of makeup isn't that important for this, but we're keeping this makeup pretty close to the 1983 original from the television series V. Then we'll fix the costume, go out in the garage, record the scenes where the skin of her face hasn't been ripped off and return to the studio and take half of the makeup off. That's where the reptile skin is going. Then pop in a contact with a reptile eye and bring out your clay or other mold construction kits you have. We're gonna make a reptile mask with latex. Create your own reptilian patterns in the clay. You see here Ellie's making space for the eye. And then she fades the edges of the clay here. That way the edge of the latex will fade as well and become thinner. Pour on the latex and make sure you get it in all the crevices and holes and whatever you, patterns you made. Let it dry for a while and then apply another layer and another layer. Use a hair dryer to speed up the process. And boom, you have a mask. Ellie used green clay when she created the actual mask so that's why it's a little greenish in tone. We cut it up in pieces to match the model's face and apply latex on both the skin and the mask. And please be careful not to get the latex in your eyes. Then Ellie applies a little oil on the model's brow so the latex won't stick to her eyebrows. Apply the upper piece. and start with a paint job. And as always, you can do whatever you want with the colors. We went for green, since they were green in the television series. Yeah, and Ellie's using green and a little yellow to brighten things up and mix it up with a little black. All grease-based colors. And reptile in Swedish is reptil. And lizard is and if you follow us on Instagram, you would already know we were doing this makeup. 
because that's where we post previews and extras. Alimax SFX. Then she continues with the um, sculpt gel. We need to create a little flappy skin around the lizard part. And you can use scar wax or latex and cotton pads or whatever you have. And she's using oil here to smooth the edges out. Then we're ready to match up the skin color with the edges using foundation. And after one round of foundation, we add a little powder, then go over it once more with foundation. Using a smaller brush here to get all the little skin pieces matched up. Yup, and these aliens bleed green, so we actually used some washing up liquid on the edges here of the flappy skin. It's not touching your own skin, so it's perfectly safe. You can of course use uh, food coloring and uh, your own gooey mix of stuff to create this. <laughs> and then we created a very rough eye on a piece of latex for Ellie to rip off the alien in the intro movie. And there you have it! Your V-Series 1983 reptile alien look bleh.